Hi, welcome to another episode of Medicine Simplified. In this episode, we will learn about cranial nerves. How many cranial nerves are there? What are their origin, functions, and other anatomical information? This episode is divided into two parts, and second part link will be provided in description. Cranial nerves are the nerves that emerge directly from brain and brainstem. Cranial nerves emerge from central nervous system above the level of first vertebra of vertebral column. Cranial nerves relay electrical impulses between your brain and different parts of your head, face, neck, and torso. There are total twelve pairs of cranial nerves, one nerve on each side. So there will be. 12 cranial nerves on one side and 12 on other side they carry both efferent and efferent fibers that means they carry sensory and motor fibers here is a diagram of 12 cranial nerves originating from brain stem first cranial nerve is olfactory nerve second cranial nerve is optic nerve third cranial nerve is oculomotor nerve Fourth cranial nerve is trochlear nerve. Fifth cranial nerve and largest cranial nerve is trigeminal nerve. Sixth cranial nerve is abducens nerve. Seventh cranial nerve is facial nerve. Eighth cranial nerve is vestibulo cochlear nerve. Ninth cranial nerve is glossopharyngeal nerve. Tenth cranial nerve is vagus nerve. Eleventh cranial nerve is axillary cranial nerve, and twelfth cranial nerve is hypoglossal nerve. Now we will know anatomical information of cranial nerves. Coming to first cranial nerve, that is olfactory nerve. it is a sensory nerve function is olfactory that is smell it originates from olfactory mucosa in nasal cavity and terminates in olfactory bulbs beneath the frontal lobe of brain cranial passage is cribriform plate of ethmoid bone coming to cranial nerve 2 that is optic nerve it is also sensory now coming to the function they relay impulses related to vision it originates from retina and terminates in thalamus it passes through optic foramen next one is cranial nerve 3 that is oculomotor now it is predominantly motor now function is it helps in movement of eye opening of eyelid constriction of pupil focusing of pupil proprioception it originates from midbrain and terminates in somatic fibers lead to levator papillary superioris superior medial and inferior rectus and inferior oblique muscles and parasympathetic fibers of oculomotor nerve enters eye ball and lead to constrictors of iris and ciliary muscles of lens it passes through superior orbital fissure coming to cranial nerve 4 that is trochlear nerve it is predominantly motor nerve coming to the function also helps in movement of eye and proprioceptive impulses it originates from midbrain and terminates in superior oblique muscles of eye it passes through superior orbital fissure in part 2 video we will discuss about cranial nerve 5 to 12 and link will be provided in description if you like this video please do subscribe to our channel thank you